Good morning cultists! In our previous episode, we left things off after laying waste to Negrond and Harganeth. Unfortunately, um, they're about to take or attack Hexawaddle, I think. I do hope that this guy is too far away to attack Warprotect though, because otherwise we might be in a spot of trouble. Although... Once he gets out of raiding stance, he should be able to reach him, I think. Actually, you know what? I don't know if this is counting the raid raiding stance or if this is in his full normal stance. Hmm. I guess we'll find out. Hopefully not, though. In any case, uh, we need to go with a new technology, and I think we'll go with... Hmm. Armor for our siege stuff or our weapons team stuff. Um, or promoted on merit. New warpstone uses. Let's go for increase in casualty replenishment rate. Thank you. And Pustin has not moved. Um, I guess you can try to block her army. Hmm, I think maybe we should have sent you out to Nagaron just in case. Oh, so in between episodes, I did something. I actually went ahead and, um... What's it? Explore the ruins in the Tower of Lysine and Kalidor's Repose. I did that because I figured it would be one of those um, stupid puzzles that I hate. What's unfortunate is that we actually had an Under Empire built in Tower of Lysine in our last turn. And my friends, the followers of Nagash, just destroyed my work. And now we have to wait another 10 turns before we can get another thingamajig um, built. Wow. Thanks, guys. Thanks. Good grief. Maybe they weren't aware, but still. Bit of a dick move, I must say. Alright, well, I don't think there's anything left for us to do. Um, so I guess we can just continue on? Yeah. I suppose if we want to avoid attrition as we move, we might want to use the underway for this region. Although, every time we do... Okay, so they failed their ritual. And they are indeed attacking us here. Hmm. So he's attacking our lord. Right, as opposed to the army. It does say that the balance of power is good. Um. I'll be perfectly honest with you. I'm tempted to auto-resolve this because I have no confidence in my own abilities to be able to fend these guys off. Hmm. Although... This could be interesting. So, we have a fairly decent army. I mean, obviously it's not fully stacked, but... Sure. Uh, that's a War Hydra, right? Um... They don't have any Harganeth Executions and whatnot, so maybe we'll be alright. You know what? Let's do this manually. If this doesn't work out, then it doesn't work out. At the very least, we can drop a nuke on them and make them considerably weaker for when we um, send in reinforcements up north, which will of course be approximately 50 episodes from now. Good god, I hope not. <laughs> Alright, so our reinforcements are coming in from that side, which is very unfortunate because that's kind of in between us and them. Hmm. Alright, actually we can have both of you guys together because you're both assassins. Alright, this is going to be quite tough. I'll tell you that much. Do we want to maybe move back a little bit? Just to give our reinforcements a bit more time to get here? Yeah, I guess. Or, if we go up in the hills, maybe we can stay hidden for a little while. Except for our doom wheel. Hmm. That might not be a bad idea. Because Skaven are all about the ambush. Alright, Doomwheel, why don't you situate yourself over there? But if that's the case, then I think they'll just start going after our... Um, you know what? Sure. Why not? Why not? Okay. So they have some regiments of renowned harpies, which is kind of interesting. What is this? Warpstone Doom Rocket and Warp Bomb? Warp Bomb? Oh, I'm assuming that's what we get for having the highest level, um, uh, what's it? Defensive structures. Right, and they're sending their Doomfire Warlocks at us immediately. Interesting. 
Alright, uh, why don't you guys go ahead and meet those guys? I can never tell what the Doomfire Warlocks are for. I guess they're just fast in, uh, cavalry? Alright, um... We have a lot of Rat Ogres, who I guess are... I don't know if they would make a good counters to those dudes. And I think we're going to... Oh, shoot. Are they going for the Doomfire Warlocks? Or, sorry, the, um, Doom Meal? Or what? Okay. And you seem to be making... Well, not exactly mincemeat, but, um... Decent headway with the, uh, cavalry here. And I think we'll have to have you guys go after the, um, Lord. What with them being on a, uh, dragon and whatnot. No, Warp Lightning Cannon, don't! No, don't! Come back! No! Please! No! Not like this! I'm so sorry! I've neglected you! Ah! Oh. Dicks. Dicks shoved inside of many butts. Fuck. How does this work, by the way? Uh, powerful explosion, sacrifice Oh, I see. So, we get them to explode. That's what it is. Interesting. Um, can you guys go after the Lord, please? I know it's a bit of a uh, strange order, but please. All right, let's have you guys blow up. Go for it. What? Hit points greater than... What? Really? But no, their hit points are greater than 50%. What are you talking about, man? Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Alright, um, I think we might have a little bit of problems with our... Uh, with a the Lord there, unfortunately. And you guys are pretty much done with those dudes. Um, so why don't you start moving on on those assholes. Doom Wheel, um, maybe not tussle with the War Hydra? I don't think they're anti-large, but still. Better that we avoid that, I guess. Mm, plague Monks, why don't you guys get back a little bit, because I am planning on exploding the uh, things here. And it doesn't work. I don't understand. Wait, what is the stipulation here? Cannot target if unit is Lord or Hero. Hit points... Oh, I see. The hit points have to be lower than 50%. Oh, I get it. Okay. Okay, sorry. I didn't fully understand what was uh, going on. Um, is their lord just continuously harassing our poison wind mortars? Come on, guys. Come on. All right. Clan rats, please be below 50% health soon, because I need to blow you guys the fuck up. No? Still no? What? Can they not be running away? Oh, no. Um... Did it... Did it work? I am very confused as to what just happened. And our Plague Monks and Storm Vermin with Halberds are buggering off. Fantastic. Oof. Oof, indeed. Alright, Doomfire Warlocks, you guys are about dead. Fantastic. And Dark Shards, that's right, punk-ass bitches. Okay, I don't know what their War Hydra is doing, but it appears to be buggering off. So, why don't our Warp Lock Gisales go after those dudes instead? Mm, and I gotta say, our reinforcements came in really clutch. Uh, clutch? Sorry, clutch. I don't know what a clutch is, but um, they came in clutch for sure. I mean, we'll definitely see a lot of casualties with our reinforcements, but... You know, what with them just being a garrison and all that such, I'm not that concerned, I would say. Alright, let's get you guys spawning over there. And I don't think we're gonna need to use our uh, nukes anytime soon. Hopefully. Yes. Globadiers. How are you doing against the uh, black guard there? Making your way? Fantastic. Our plague claw catapult's pretty much dead, but that's fine. It's not like they were part of the main army anyway, so... It's all good. Especially since they get um, automatically reinforced, pretty much. Maybe go after the War Hydra? I don't know if our dudes against the War Hydra is the best idea, but whatever. Alright. Oh, whoa! Interesting! Wow! That's a really good combination. Menace Below and Warp Bomb? I like it. I like it a lot. Alright, these guys are almost done. Fantastic. And how are you doing against the... Um, apparently... Maybe going up against the Hydra, not the best idea? 
Yeah, why don't you just lead him on a merry run around? Uh oh. And he's about booking it. Good grief. Um, can you not die, please? Oh shit. Please don't. Not like this. Not like this. Alright. We're gonna need some distractions here. Get the fuck out of here, dude. Oh, you got, um... Oh, the Master Assassin guys actually have, uh, ranged. Interesting. Uh, no. Deathwind Globadiers attack the Blackguard of Nagaron, because... Our... Storm Vermin aren't gonna be as useful against them as you guys are. Fan-fucking-tastic. I do wonder how much damage we cause to our own, um... Storm Vermin with those, uh... Deathwind Globadier guys. I do wonder. Hmm. If you guys can stay put, I wouldn't mind blowing you up. But, uh... It seems that they're quite content to uh, bugger off and run away with their tails tucked between their legs. Which is understandable. And of course, our Storm Vermin not doing so hot against the Hydra. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, mortars. Oh, they're rallying. Interesting. Alright. Rattling Gunners, where are you guys? Everyone, go after the Hydra here, please. Except for maybe the mortars. I think you guys might end up doing more damage to our own dudes than the, uh... Than our, um... Than you would help. Alright, so he's poking it. He is straight up shattered. Why don't you guys uh, turn back towards the um, dudes there. And we'll blow you Plague Monk Sensor Bearers up. Okay, well, that didn't accomplish too much, which is unfortunate. Mm, and it's only just their Lord left, I think. Mm. Try to finish this Hydra off. Yeah, and also the Black Art of Nagaron there. All right. Maybe Blake Priest or Dude go after that guy. Or the uh, Black Guard there. Can you finish these guys off, please? They're just deck hands. Or dark shards. Why did I see deck hands? Starts with a D, has an H, and that's it. That's the only reason why I thought it said deck hands. Fantastic. Or did I mean dick hands? Which is, of course, a rare condition upon which you grow um, penises instead of fingers. All right, I think we're done. All right, not bad. Not bad at all. No full casualties with our um, main army, which is great. Uh, not a lot of dudes left in the garrison army, but that's fine. So I think what we'll do is we'll take Warpatech to um, finish off Sotarath. Mm, do we want to go with the units replenished or food? I guess we'll go with food. Sure. All right, look at that. Fantastic. Would have been nicer if we had uh, completely finished him off, but that's fine. Oh, Morathi. Oh, you sexy, sexy girl, Morathi. All right. Uh, now, the question is, do we want to stick around to weaken Nagron some more? Or do we just move on and um, continue on with our lives and do our own ritual stuff? Hmm... I mean, I guess as long as we can def defend our borders, it's fine. But I'm kind of scared that Nagaron will be able to uh, regenerate. So... I don't know. I mean, where do we draw the line, right? Where do we draw the line? Mm, yeah, we might want to start heading back home. And they didn't repopulate Nagaron? Really? Wow, I am genuinely surprised. Wait, why can't you do anything with Nagarond? Can you not explore it? Wait, what? Is it because it's nuked? What is with this guy? I don't understand. Enemy Dreadlord Hero. Right. Okay. And it does seem like the green bar is getting lower and lower, which is great. Hmm. Okay. Maybe we destroy a few more armies and then we go back home. Hmm. But 
I feel like we're just gonna be going down a uh, rabbit hole this way. Yeah, because we can lose so much time uh, destroying these guys because they're so expansive. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. What do we do? What do we do? They have too many um, ter things down here, so I think... Mm. Alright, you know what? Let's just go for it. Tell me that Spite Reach is not all that well garrisoned. Murta, can you take it by yourself, please? You can. Add a fucking boy. Alright, just occupy that shit. There's no need to um, go all crazy and shit. Good job. Do we need the rubbish scrap heap? Uh, not really. Fruit draft compressors. Squashing uh, sour fruits creates an intoxicating drink better than Skaven brew. Yes, yes. Wow. Are we making Skaven wine? That's incredible. All right, so black Ar black pillar and how arc we might want to take. I guess this is kind of us taking the um, the. Um, What's it? North Pole and all that such, right? Yeah. Now, I don't mind these guys being uh, stuck in... Um... Ulthwan. But... Mm, anywhere outside... Is dangerous, I think. Alright, uh... Go for augmented weapons. And I guess maybe explore Vol's Anvil? Is that the capital of that place? It is. Gotcha. Alright. Warp attack, time to get your revenge. Annihilate. Atta fucking boy. Alright, dude. Uh, let's get you down to Swamp Town so that you can, um, you know, get the rest of your troops, I guess. And you have leveled up, so we'll get you mortal, uh, Immortality and what else? Alright, uh, finish off with replenish troops. Sweet. Murta. Good job with your uh, taking of that settlement. I'm gonna get you slippery. And who's up next? Ikit Claw. Ah, uh, you're fine. Oh, you know what? I think we need to rename our dudes here. Let's see. Uh, Chief Butt Sex. Elusive. Mm, Warp Attack. You are now going to be none other than Vanthus. Welcome. To the world as a Skaven scum, Vanthus. <laughs> Ixstone the Dominator. Uh, we'll name you after... Hmm... Let's go for... A name that I haven't used in quite some time. I guess we'll go with... Richie. Wait, have I not used Richie in a while? Richie the Dominator. Yeah, sounds good. Yeah. And it's going to be another three turns before he is able to uh, head out. Gotcha. Alright. Mm, static, Matrix. Matrix and Static are... Matrix and DN are good to head out. Uh, let's get you guys towards the Great Arena. Sure. And Skrulk is still replenishing. Oh, I also remember that we can just do this. Ah, shoot. Alright, the Navalon, uh, let's get you back into the Black Bite Tower. Oh. Turns out your replenishment there isn't as good as I thought it would be. What? It's even worse? Oh, it's because he was inside Harganeth. Right. Right, okay, I see. Mm. No, just go down there. Engenbolt, continue destroying the walls of Gron. Fantastic. And we will give you the last bit of brittle bones. Alright, so Grand, Ashrak, Great Arena. All those places obviously need to be destroyed. Uh, so that'll be the northern part of this area pretty much done and dusted. Assuming that our allies here can take on uh, Dagrak's end. Yeah, concentrate on that. I'll take care of this. And then maybe we'll work on a little bit of this. Hit some of these guys on the way down, and then we'll just come back home, I think. We might drop by to destroy Malekith, just in case, but... We can actually do that with Ikit and the other dudes here. Hmm... They're not gonna get destroyed anytime soon, are they? Alright, then I think we'll just wait until we have one turn left, and then just completely annihilate the Temple of Skulls. 
Yeah, it's, it's obviously not great, but that's fine. Judging by how our strategy of um, disrupting the uh, Dark Elves at the last second uh, worked out, I'd say that might be the way to go. Alright, what else do we want to build here? I guess the Rattling Warns. And we'll build a defensive wall. Sweet. Does anyone need anything else? Any, uh... Ooh. Mm, I guess. Just in case we need to hire some more uh, lords in the future. It would be nice to have that extra... Um, one level higher up thing. Wait, where the fuck did Pustin go? What do you want? Oh! A trade agreement. I'm gonna have to say no, sir, because I... May need to go to war with you. I mean, obviously I don't... Oh no, I guess they're not taking Dagrax and then. Gotcha. Oof. Big oofs. Whoa, look at that! Holy shit! The balance of power is almost equal now. Damn. We might be able to overtake them. Yeah, you know what? Let's just strike while the iron is hot. If it seems like it's gonna take too long, then maybe I'll do some of this off-camera. And then we'll come back once we are in a better spot to be able to uh, do our ritual. Mm, chromatic armor is fairly nice, but just give him some experience points. Sure, why not? Wow, a lot of fucking uh, things happening. And let's have Avalon be badly mutated. Fantastic. <laughs> All right, I think before the uh, garrison in Gron gets too powerful, we might want to hit them now. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, where is our lord? Or our Engenbolt? Damage the walls, please. Attaboy. And we will give you Arcane Conduit. Hmm. I just realized that it would have been cool if we gotten the, um, uh, assassin sorcerer dude inside of our team here just to see what it's like. But, oh well, that's fine. Choices were made, mistakes were made, etc., etc. Alright, um, do we want Static to be the one to attack? Or maybe Skrull or DN? I guess we haven't had, uh, any of these guys really showcase their talents just yet. Alright, you know what? Mm, DN, why don't you get into position? Static, get into position. And we'll have Matrix lead the attack on Grand. Die, die. What? Wall strength is 33%? How did that happen? Oh, I may have forgotten to uh, damage the walls here recently. Oops. Alright. Well, what kind of terrain are we fighting in, by the way? Hopefully it's one of my favorite maps. Where we just get to uh, sit back and bombard- Yep! We're doing it. <laughs> Nice. Very nice. Although, uh, this garrison is going to be a lot stronger than before. That being said, the AI tends to crowd their troops around the uh, front of the gates, or around the uh, gates, so... I think, as long as we get all of our uh, mortar dudes in together, we should be good. Unfortunately, their towers are all online, and our reinforcements are coming in from the left side this time, which is actually pretty good. Alright. Why don't you guys actually group up together, even though you're not really meant to be grouped up, I guess. Mm, rat Ogres, Doom Flayers, Doom Wheel, Hell Pit Abomination, and all the other usual dudes, I guess. Alright. Guys, you know the drill. Scooch! Scooch or booch? I don't know what a booch is. I'm hoping that it's not kind of like some weird racial slur that I've never heard about. Alright, I think we're... Good. No, wait, we're not quite good, obviously. There we go. No, nope, we're still not good. Who's this? Who the fuck is that? Oh, warp fire throwers. Sorry, I completely forgot about your existence. All right, play claw catapults. You guys can uh, start destroying the towers. It should be just one shot kills at this point. Yes. Destroy. 
Oh, that one's not quite um, one-shot kill, it seems. How dare you? How dare you? All right, that one's down. Destroy this one, please, before they cause any more additional damage to our dudes. And dudes? Whoa, wait, what? They have some kind of like fireball towers? Oh. Maybe this must be the uh, highest version of their defensive towers. Fuck me. Alright, well, thankfully we can scooch our booch fairly uh, easily here. Sure. Just... Just pile up in there. You guys all stink. Now is not the uh, time to, com to be complaining about your um, various body odors and whatnot. Alright, so we have three poison wind... Uh, mortars. Gotcha. Why don't you guys get set up over here and start pelting those assholes. Specifically their assholes. No other part of their body should come to harm. Excuse me? Did you just kill one of my mortar dudes? Unfucking believable Wow. Dick move, AI. Dick move. How dare you? I did nothing to you thus far. I mean, I destroyed your wall or your towers, but still. Nothing in comparison to the damage that you've caused to my uh, poison wind uh, mortars. Uh, why don't you guys start attacking their Black Art of Nagaron? Bleak swords are fairly weak, so we don't need to worry about them too much. Mm, and I think they also have some Harganeth Executioners? Or do they not? They don't? Weird. I could have sworn that they do, but I guess not. Very odd. Alright, look at that. A lot of damage being caused. Fantastic. Uh, who else needs to kind of get into position here? I guess the rest of our artillery dudes. Why not? And Warplock Gisales. You guys also need to get into position. Please and thank you. Sweet. How are you guys doing so far? You know what, Death Glow Bombardiers? You guys don't deserve your own team. Alright. Work on these guys next, please. But they have a death hag, which is interesting. Hmm. All right, bleak swords. Let's not uh, waste our ammunition on them. Black art corsairs, uh, not as powerful as the Harganeth executioners and whatnot. So maybe we don't worry about them either. Hmm. Want to maximize our ammunition usage here, obviously. All right, so let's go after. Ooh, nice. Holy crap. Can't believe that our Warplock Gisales are actually shooting through the wall there. Fan fucking tastic. Can't hit the um, Black Guard right behind the gates, can you? No, I guess not. They're moving, which is not what we want. Hmm. You know what? Don't fire at will. Because you guys just prone you guys are just prone to uh, waiting wasting ammunition. How about you try to finish some of these guys off, because they're fairly low health. And? Is it working? There we go. Cut their numbers down to about half. Fantastic. Sweet. Uh, Black Dark Corsairs with hand bows. Dark Riders with shields. Mm, more Black Guard over here. Shit. Black Dark Corsairs with hand bows. Not too, too powerful, so let's not worry about that. Play Claw Catapult, can you actually destroy the tower there? Because I kind of want to position our uh, Poison Wind Mortars to hit the uh, Black Guard over that way. There we go. Alright. Do it. Do it. Uh, Warp Block to Zales, I think you guys are kind of wasting your ammunition at this point. Sorry, guys. Jeez. Idiots. I mean, uh, good job. Yeah, you did amazingly there. Absolutely fantastic. Alright, so once we take this tower out, we should be good to... I guess we can just do it now. Yeah, why don't you guys just uh, get in a little bit closer and start pelting those assholes. And specifically their assholes. Although, I do wonder if maybe we should take out the Dark Riders as well. What? Excuse me, Dark Charge with shields? Who the fuck do you think you are? Alright, Mortars, get back a little bit? Don't be such dinguses. No one better die. Good grief. 
Alright, we're gonna have to position you guys over this way then, I guess. Alright, so we'll try to hit the uh, Black Art of Nagarond. Wait, it's not... Wow. Their positioning of their troops is just infuriating sometimes. <laughs> oh well. Hmm. Alright. Whenever you're in position, go for it. Do it. That's right, punk ass bitch. Eat shit. Fantastic. Hmm. We have about maybe. Well, I guess it kind of depends on the team, but. We're almost through our ammunition, unfortunately, so. Uh, man, it'd be amazing if we can uh, regenerate ammunition with our poison wind uh, mortars. I don't see why we can't. I feel like these guys could just carry around um, beakers or something and, you know, fart into them. I'm sure Skaven farts are pretty deadly, right? And then, boom, instant ammunition uh, regeneration. Or at least, that's what I think. That's what I would do, and that's what I commonly do um, whenever I run out of, um, you know, gas bombs and whatnot. Alright, uh... It would be nice to get rid of some of the um, Black Eye Corsairs. Maybe the Warplock Gisales might be able to uh, help these guys. Hmm, Dark Shards? I don't know if our Warp Lightning Cannons will be able to hit those dudes. Considering that they don't really have a an arc. Then maybe you guys can hit the Black Eye Corsairs instead. Wow, fantastic. Death Globe Bombardiers are not going to be able to get into range to be able to hit these guys, unfortunately. I should have actually uh, done more Menace Below. I completely neg neglected that fact. Oops. That's fine. Alright, Static Display. Can you do Assault of Stone on these guys on the walls? Or no? Um, Doesn't say that we can't target them on the walls, so maybe we'll be alright. What we could do is maybe drop it on these bastards. Otherwise, Black Art Corsairs. Oh man, there's a lot of fucking assholes over here. How close do you have to be? You basically have to be inside their walls. Hmm. Alright, well, you know what? We'll just lob it on them. And here we go. Boom. Fantastic. Killed about half. Wow. Gotta say. I like Assault of Stone. Can you do Crack's Call on the Black Art of Nagaron there? Finish them off? Go for it, buddy. Don't worry about the uh, pelting of your butthole. The fuck was that? Did it do anything at all? I didn't see anything at all. What the fuck? That was weird. Weird and off-putting. Oh, I forgot to, to um, tell you guys to uh, auto-fire. That's why you weren't firing. I was like, wait, can you actually not see them or something? No, turns out I was just a big dum dum. Gotcha. All right, so that's that pretty much done and dusted. Hmm, let's have you moving on to the dark shards there instead, please. All right, we'll have our lords and uh, assassins. I think lead the charge. Sure. That way we can uh, prevent the brunt of their damage. I think. Wait, was the gate not destroyed yet? Oh, interesting. Hmm, Giselles, can you hit the uh, Death Hag? Is that possible at all? Possibly? Yes. Yes, they can. They're making short work of them. And Matrix has rushed right in to um, get pelted with a swarm of arrows right off the bat. Not great. Alright, we might want to uh, do this instead. Uh, let's do Deadly Onslaught. Even though I think that might have been... Explosion allows chance to escape melee. Oh, really? Interesting. Hopefully you're making short work of the uh, Black Art of Nagaron. And I've noticed one thing about um, my playthrough of this, um, of this campaign thus far. I have kind of neglected to um, get a close eye uh, view on our troops as they tear our enemies' buttholes asunder. Which I definitely should have been doing more of. Oops. Alright, uh, Storm Vermin, I think we're gonna need to get you guys in here now. I should have actually uh, brought you in much sooner, but oh well. And weapons teams? Hmm, I don't know if you're gonna be uh, super helpful in this case, but whatever. Wow! 
Right. Holy shit. Gotta say, the Blackguard are interesting in that they somehow are staying there even though they're getting completely annihilated. Did the Blackguard really do that much damage to these dudes? Hot oh, damn. I think we're gonna need to do some uh, Remnus Valor and get the fuck out of dodge. Hmm. Yeah, let's back up a little bit, guys. I seem to have underestimated our enemy, unfortunately. Oh my god, they're just being pelted with arrows. Fuck me. We could just nuke them, but I feel like that'd be a bit of a waste of nukes. Can you get out of here, please? Reminis Valor and get the fuck off. Get away. Move. Get out of here. Go. Scoot. Scoot your boot. Or your boot, or whatever the fuck I um, said before. Alright, so that's just your Doom Wheel. Let's have our Doom Wheel go after those bastards. Uh, 14 Blackguard of Nagaron left. I don't know if our Rat Ogres are going to be the best ones to use against them, but we might be able to cause enough damage to not have to worry about those bastards anymore. What in the 7 million dickholes are you doing, DN? I didn't tell you to fucking escape that way, you idiot. Where are you going? I mean, I like that you just plowed right through them, but where the fuck are you? Um, okay, bye, I guess. That was weird. Weird and off-putting, but weird. Mostly. Wait, is that you? Is that our Doom player doing that, or what? Who keeps doing that? That's, that's gotta be a Dark Elf spell, right? I mean, it's got the right coloration and everything. Hmm. All right, help an abomination. Unleash hell. Do it, buddy. Do it. Do they have a? Oh my god. All right. I think we're just gonna do this because. Hmm. Otherwise, it might be too much for us to handle. That's fine. That's fine. We'll just make another nuke. All right. Clan rats are buggering off, which is of course. Surprising to no one. Our Doom Wheel not doing so hot there either. Whoa, very nice. We pretty much destroyed three armies right there. Fan fucking tastic. Right, we might need to get our help at Abomination to uh, back up a little bit too. Yeah, I think sticking him here by himself, maybe not the wisest choice. I don't know what the Harpies are gonna do though. Oh well. None of my business, I guess. Assassins, um, let's get you guys to maybe, I don't know, do something? Rat Ogres, what are you up to? Yeah, you know what, go after the uh, Black Art Corsairs. Doom Flayers, we might need you to back up a little bit. You've taken a considerable amount of damage. And Doom Flayer, or sorry, Doom Wheel, why don't you go after the, uh, um, ranged guys there. Alright, so the Cold One Knights, I don't know if they're anti-large. Are they anti-large? They are. Okay, so you shouldn't be going up against the Rat Ogres. Gotcha. Alright, Halberdiers, why don't you go after the um, Cold One Knights. Rat Ogres, try to back up if you can. Did you just vomit on my Rat Ogres? Come on, man. Even as a Skaven, that's pretty uh, fucking disgusting. What the fuck am I... Rattling Gunner's doing right now. No idea. No fucking clue. Alright, Halberdiers, go after the uh, dragon, please. And Assassins, I guess you guys might as well do the same. Help at Abomination, why don't you get Tim uh, get stuck in? Oh my god. Are uh, they rattling? Oh shit, it's because they're not in the same team, that's why. Oops. My bad. Hmm. I don't know if the Doom Wheel is going to be good against the Cold One Chariot. They're not super melee oriented though, are they? So maybe we will be a decent against them. Alright, go for it, dude. Annihilate. Matrix, do not disappoint me. Hmm, Static? Nice. Should have brought you in a little bit sooner because we could have cast um, some nasty spells on these bastards. Alright, there we go. Not too many casualties. Wow. Not bad. Not bad at all.
I guess it's mostly our lords um, that took the brunt of the damage there, but uh, yeah. Good job, guys. Very good. Alright, um... Decisive victory. Fantastic. Sack that shit. And... Can you take that, Matrix? Or... Do you not have the movement? You do not have the movement. Gotcha. Then let's get DN in there. And we will occupy this shit. Fant- Ooh, what is this? Ransacked Tower Prophecy. Interesting. Alright. And uh, Warpstone Deposit, which is completely unnecessary, but I believe it does give us a opportunity to increase our garrison power and all that stuff, so sure, why not? Um, What are we building in Harganeth? I guess we'll build all the uh, advanced military stuff. That way we can build the basic military stuff in this place. Yeah, let's do that. Sure, why not? Although, you know what? Maybe instead of the Warpstone Deposit, or instead of that, we'll build that. That'll be good. Okay. Can you... Okay, you can't quite go into Replenishment Stance, which is unfortunate, but whatever. Let me just quickly level these guys up before we end the episode. Um, Might as well get you Trixie. And who else? Static? Let's get you... Ah, uh, Ancient Cunning. Matrix, um, we will finish Expeditious Endeavor and live Tyler. Uh, let's lube you up with some slipperiness. Murta's also leveled up. Alright, um, I guess then... Let's go with Master Assassin, Woundmaker. Alright, Ikit. Nope, not doing that yet. Wait, unless... Five turns to go. Gotcha. Navalon's almost uh, fully replenished. Alright, she should be good now. There we go. Oh, it's because Skrulk wasn't inside Blacklight Tower, right. Okay, then why don't you uh, stuff yourself in there? What? Is it me, or... Was Skrulk about to uh, replenish his troops more when he was outside this place? Odd. Very odd. All right, well, um... Hmm... I don't know how Ark is occupied right now. But let's end the episode off here for now. We'll come back tomorrow and uh, we'll do a little bit more damage against uh, Nagaron. And then I think we'll just uh, head back to our own uh, territory to um do our fourth ritual. Yeah. Like I said, though, um, we might come to a point where... This is taking too long, and it's just going to be the same thing over and over again. So I'll just cut that part out, if that's the case. And then we'll just resume once we um, are situated uh, and able to uh, do our next ritual stuff. Yeah, I think that'll be good. All right, so for now, thanks for watching, and have a good breakfast.